previously on Realize TV. What happened? Dude, my car caught fire. Oh. After the fire, did you replace that hose? No. Whatever problem the car has has not been fixed. All right, so there's the problem draining onto the manifold. All right, so this is a Garrett GT3076R. <laughs> anyway, the thing is that it's gonna solve, it's gonna solve all my problems. You don't know. Right. Uh, Except for the problem between the steering wheel and the seat. Ouch. Morning, Chuck. Morning. What are you doing? What are you doing? I mean, what am I doing? When what you show is up this? To, show up to someone's house, you can't say hello. Hey, I'm outside. No. Hey, how's it going? No, I gotta get it. You know, it has to be candid. Yes, everything we do is candid. That's right. What are you doing? You got a new arrow? Yeah. This is part of the hashtag final belt prep. Oh, what, what kit is this? This is a uh, BN Type 2. Authentic BN Type 2 style. Wow, so you're changing it up uh, this season, huh? Yeah, well I'm changing it up just for fun about, and then I'm going to crash at Horse Thief. And that's gonna be it. Sweet man, are you gonna rock this kit? Just a uh, black just like primer this. like this? Yeah, I'm actually gonna paint the rest of the car to match. Oh, sick. Yeah. Teddy, I gotta tell you, I'm pretty annoyed that you're here. Well, we actually have a lot of ground to cover today, so what do you say we get this show on the road? Literally a lot of ground to cover. And let's get on the road. Because okay. you decided to go drive 70 miles away to go get this arrow painted. 88 miles wow. is wow. what Google Maps said. Where we're going, we, we don't, don't need, need roads. roads. <laughs> Teddy, can you help me? Um, I mean, I have to film. You don't have to film. I have to film. This is why I'm annoyed that you're here. Teddy. What? I'm doing it! Oh my god. Oh, so, uh... <laughs> this, uh... Is this short? Dude, it, it actually doesn't even come close. Okay, hook the other side first. Okay. Oh, dude, it's in the bag. Oh, 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 oh! Send it, send this it. This thing is never... Good to go, dude. That door is never opening. <laughs> this side fits good. Looks like it, yeah. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> come on. Like I said, it's good. <laughs> what's, up, what's up with these? Why don't they fit? What do you mean? They fit just fine. Open that door again. <laughs> so how bad is this rear bumper gonna fit? It's gonna be beautiful, dude. Come on, let's do it. Hey, can you put my side screw back? No. Oh, dude, that fits great. I mean, you just let me struggle. <laughs> Man, Chuck, what would you do without a friend like me? I'd be just fine, probably. What's happening? Why don't you hang it right there? Look, that looks great. It'll make your car look lower. Eight a.m. on Sunday morning, man. Your neighbors love you here. Eight a.m. You're supposed to be up cooking breakfast. Woo woo! So it wasn't the body kit you're blaming. In fact, the wrong thing. It was your car this whole time. I told you my car's a piece. Of Okay, it's bowing out on that side, which is perfect. Bowing out on both sides. Wow. Dude, it's gonna be great. Definitely send it. Man, I'm just gonna send it and deal with it after. 
Can we go, dude? It's like 10.30. We were planning to be on the road, by the way. By what time, Chuck? I said I'd be at your house at 7.30 and we'd be on the road at 8.30. But you didn't get here. It is 10.20. At 7.30. That is not my problem, okay? Not my problem. You contracted coronavirus this morning. You were dying. I did not contract coronavirus. You were on your deathbed. Man, I don't know if you can come because... My throat does really hurt though, so bad. Coronavirus. Let's go, dude. Come on. I hate you. Hit the open road. Life is a highway. Oh, please don't sing. I wanna please ride it sing. all night long. Stop. Stop. can totally tell which house is his because it looks like oh oh it looks Wh like, uh, which one is this I don't know but it looks like a used car dealership so I'm gonna guess that this is his house Ricky are you still sleeping what happened is he still sleeping Look, dude? It's, it's noon it's already noon no, dude, let's just drop the kids off in the driveway. Look, I think I think he go. was yeah, I think he was painting late last night based on his Instagram story. So I think maybe he's you know, he's still he's still snoozing. Which is okay, you know, you work hard, you sleep hard. What is it about you not helping? What do you mean not helping? Oh. Are you really just gonna leave the kid out here? Yeah. Seems like a safe neighborhood, right? Yeah. Not like the time we picked up that one Jay-Z. Could you try calling him again? We gotta I get this show on the road, dude. I think I'm just gonna leave the kids here. You're gonna leave the kids here? Yeah. On the sidewalk? Yeah. What? You won't. I am. You won't. I did. You won't. You won't. Oh. Oh, you will. I will. Oh. Straight up. You did. I did. <laughs> All right. Well. Loki, I can't believe you actually left your kid outside his house. Dude, it'll be fine. <laughs> Dude, it's gonna be gone before he even gets a chance to grab it. No, no one is gonna want a kid that doesn't fit. Right? That's true. Yeah. So, it's fine. All right, Chuck. You ready to do this? Ready to do what? Dude, today's the day this thing's gonna start. What have you done? Is it gonna start today? Definitely not. So what have you done so far since well, the last Well, all right, time? so since we were last here, you know, I'm, we mocked the turbo up. And so one of the main things we needed was the dump tube that goes from the turbo uh -huh. to the, uh, uh -huh. to the downpipe. So now, if we put this back into place, one of the big issues was back here was the dump tube because it uses a different flange from yes. the old turbo. Yes. So I actually went and paid Jason to visit over at Rival Auto Works. Oh, you did? And uh, yeah, and we actually, he uh, helped me uh, put something together so we can fab a new so one. So you got a new flange on the turbo side. Correct. And you're going to use the old V-band from the other one. Right. And so Jason went and put that together for us. And Perfect. so did now we're going to- bring that with I you? did. So now we're going to mock it up. Six months? So Jason gave me some extra length on this. Um, and so he basically did this. So then now we can actually clock it. We have a little bit of wiggle room to clock it. Got it. Where we need, Got but this it. is a little too long. So now we're gonna see how much well, it's we need to cut. better that it's longer. Right. So this would pop into the flange like such. But then, so we're gonna have to do some cutting today to get this to be the right length, because obviously it is too long, as you can see. Let's 
good that it's too long. Right. right. Oh, God. Oh, oh wow. God. Wow. <clears throat> wow. Weird. We'll be back after this short message. <laughs> right. Oh, yeah. Jeez. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, I'm really excited, Chuck. Are you? Yeah. Things are really moving along here. Oh, yeah. This is honestly what you should have done in the first place. It is. You know, there we go. I, I really screwed up by cheaping out on the... It's not that I cheaped out, it's just that I just didn't know. You know, I just got right a stupid turbo. I was in a hurry to get the car running. So now let's figure this out. So here, I got a new flange, the T31 four bolt flange. So then we need to figure out the length of that pipe Jason gave me. And then we gotta cut it straight. And when I say we, I mean, you. I'm gonna have you. Yes. You do it since you have steady hands and I'll just make sure that you're cutting it straight and supervise. But you know like this turbo is gonna make like nice low end torque now? You have no idea. I, anything is better than the old turbo. Yeah, that's true, you can't, you, know, go, you can't go any further backwards than you did before. The other turbo didn't make any power until like 4,500 RPM and at right. peak power it only made like 280 horsepower. It's, it was like undrivable. Yeah. Mm. So that's the old piece. Dude, it's like so close. Put, put the old piece on the V band, or V band the old piece on. Okay, it's gonna be about there. I, mean, I gotta cut a ton of this. Look at all this extinguisher dust. Still. Awesome. All right. There we go. So now it is to measure the distance from the flange to the pipe. Teddy. Why? I can't believe that this is all you have. What do you mean? That works great. <sighs> Send it, brother. Come on. <laughs> There's pieces of that flying everywhere. I just got hit by some of it. <laughs> Why wow. is it that this is all you have? Wow. No, this is it. You're done. Great. You nice work. Wow, this is terrible. Oh wait, wait, wait! You don't I got have I have any one. paper. You need a you need a different wire wheel. I got you. That is terrible. <laughs> that is terrible. Perfect. <laughs> if you don't clean this up, it's just it's not gonna weld. Come on, Chuck. Put your back into it. My back is into it. Yeah, dude, it looks brand new. On this side. Same thing. Well, you just, well here, well, you, it was an inch for this, but we actually, so now we're just. No, you're gonna mark this side now. Mark this side. Okay. I, don't, I don't know. I don't know what he's talking about. I'm just going with it. Okay. Yo, this fits different now that it dropped. It You're lying. Fit. I'm serious. It doesn't. It doesn't. This thing doesn't touch anymore. It doesn't touch where it was. Boy, why'd you drop it? I didn't drop it. You dropped it. I didn't drop it. And you dropped it. I saw you drop it. Were you recording when that happened? No. You, you dropped it. Is it. You think this is gonna fit in the chop saw? This will fit in the chop saw. You sure? If you hold. The it. next thing is that the chop saw doesn't cut straight. But I mean, probably cuts more straight than a grinder. I mean, if you don't know how to cut with a grinder. You don't know how to cut with a grinder, so yeah, all right. Chuck, do you know how to cut with a grinder? Chuck knows how to use the app grinder. Right. Yeah. Typically, I would say send it, but actually my whole making it to final bout depends on us not cutting this pipe wrong. This is really happening. I thought you were joking. I offered it as a joke. I. I didn't think he'd actually do it. He's actually doing it. I mean, at this rate, he, he might there. be done cutting by final <laughs> oh, <dude. laughs> All right, sending it with a grinder then. Are you gonna just send it with a grinder? Yes, because you are ill-equipped in this storage unit. Better you than me. At least I have someone to blame if this goes south. Maybe you should do it. No, no, I don't no, want no, no, you, you already, to blame you already me. volunteered. 
But if you get this wrong, I don't make it to final bout. All right. I'm talking about magic, right? Yeah, and then mock it up, and then we'll take it to Richard, right? Today, yeah. Oh, don't drop that. Wow, you don't deserve to be working on. Cars. Why did you drop that? Wow, you don't know what you're doing. Honestly, listen, Chuck. Honestly, listen here, Chuck. No idea what you're doing. Listen, don't film this because it's embarrassing. Wow, it's great. Wow, <laughs> <laughs> what an idiot. <laughs> Oh, I think it's still too long. No, you don't know what you're doing. Is what's the problem is. Alright, so we just spent the last hour back and forth cutting this up. But, what do you think, Chuck? It's a little bit of fine tuning and I think it's, it's like, it's snug as a glove. Yeah. It's, not, it's not welded or anything and it's in there. Right. One, two three pieces so got the clearance right here yeah. and barely against the firewall but I mean I feel like it's actually always been like that yeah and it's not gonna it's not it's not gonna bother anything. so now if only we had a welder to tack this into place if only you had a welder to tack this into place no 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 but no. you know what man created JB weld oh no to keep it in place oh no no oh no I'm gonna do mark it I'm marking it, bro. Mark it. I'm marking it, brother. Dude, budget turbo install. Yeah. You saw it here first on Realize TV. Cheap ass tip. <laughs> Not even, dude. All right, I think the last thing I want to do today is install this new wastegate. Oh. It's of the old 38 mil tile wastegate, which is a little too small. It's okay. gonna, we're gonna, it's gonna give us, I guess, a very high boost. Don't mind the. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, burnt there. So I'm replacing it with a tile 44 mil wastegate from 38 mil. So we've got our new 44 mil tile wastegate that's falling apart in my hand. My goodness. I actually do need to figure out which spring to are put in. Are lowering springs? Yeah, these are lowering springs. Danny said the 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 uh, softest one there is, because I'm a soft guy. Do you know which one the softest one is? Please don't go off of what your dinky little hands feel. <laughs> Not that one. Dude, they're color coded. This, this one's winning. They're color coded. Well, where's the manual? All right. You stepped on it a couple times. This actually doesn't tell you which spring to use. It just says spring. Thank you, Tile. Thank you for that. Thank you for that information. Look it up online. Thank you, but no thank you. Okay, these ones I feel like are gonna be the stiffest ones. Oh, well, you have no idea. What you're doing. <laughs> you have no idea. Isn't what this you're this doing. isn't how you figure out which That's wastegate no, spring to no. use? Oh my <laughs> are gosh. you sure? That's not how you check. How much boost do you think this one does? I don't know. All right, check. So, based on my measurements, I think this is gonna give me about 8.7 psi. That's your measurement? Does that have anything to do with the chart? No, no, no. I mean, you know. <laughs> it's just like... <laughs> 8, 8.6, 8.7 pounds? 8.7 is what you got from that? Okay. I think so. Okay. Yep, you just match the... You yep. Match the... Wow, that's like... It's literally... Yeah, look at that. Kindergarten stuff. Yeah, yeah I mean, you, you can't get it wrong, right? No. This is probably right. Okay, tile... No. Alright, great. So... Great. So now let's... Start tighten this back up. Yeah. Alright. 
Fuck off. It's almost like uh, you've never done this before. Yeah, dude, this is a very awkward position, okay? Dude, this is so much nicer than before. Well, yeah, it's better than the eBay one that you had before. It was not eBay. Amazon, my bad. Oh, yeah, that's the stuff. Go, oh, nice. I can actually do, I can do like a nice straight down dump tube because now I can, I can position this any way I want. It's just sick. Yeah, angle wise. You yeah. definitely still need something. I need a tube, yeah, but I don't have to do a bed, so Richard could actually make this pretty easily. Oh, yeah. Oh, interesting. New development. What? Me. All right, Chuck, thanks to my ingenuity. No, no. <laughs> I just want you guys to know that. Thanks to my ingenuity, there is finally no footage, got this on. There is no footage of the wastegate actually going on because Tenny needed my help to put the V-band on. No, so, no. Thanks to my ingenuity. No, 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 no. It's no, on now. No, and Teddy no. can do the easy part. Oh, hell no. Where he takes no. credit and hell just no. torques down the V band. Hell no. All right, guys, that's all the time that we've got for today. We've got the dump tube all mocked up and ready to get welded up at Rival Auto Works. We've got the new wastegate on, and we're getting closer and closer to dyno time. We're going to be testing this car at the Horse Thief Mile. And guys, don't forget, if you guys have made it this far into the video, don't forget to smash that smash button, hit that subscribe, like, everything button down below. We'll see you next time.